Hello, my name is Keith Appleton. Today we're going to show how to construct a pipe fitting for a model showman's engine on a crappy American South Bend lathe. As you can see now, we're cutting the bar stock. We've got it fixed eccentrically in the full job chuck. Normally I'd make a comment about my hemorrhoids at this point, but I'm too busy focusing on the work to do so. Looking good. It's a little dull, huh? It's all right. Right now, we're basically, we're just turning a piece of cylinder stock, holding it eccentrically in a four-jaw chuck, and we're going to make a 90-degree pipe elbow with some special threading. It's going to have male thread on one end, 730 seconds 40 model engineering thread, and then a uh, female 316 40 model engineering thread on the other end. This is going to be to hold the steam gauge for Phil's showman's engine. Since for some reason it was missing. Oh. Okay, let's take a measurement. Oh, it looks good. 415. So we're looking for 2, 218, 217. Nobody's to go. This is the milling portion of the pipe elbow operation I was telling you about. This is, we, you see how we eccentrically turned a piece of round stock into this sort of blank for a pipe fitting so we could offset the male part of the pipe fitting. So we had more on this side to make the 90 degree bend. We have now drilled a cross passage, it's communicative. We're now just milling down, we're sort of just gonna carve out the shape of the pipe elbow and then use coarse files to get it to the shape that we want at the very end. This is a South Bend 9A with a milling attachment in it. A lot of people like to complain about what you can't do with one, but if you have any sort of imagination it's not hard to find ways to make them useful. The only limits of a manual hobbyist machine is your imagination. This is sort of a budget Keith Appleton video. I think we should call it like Keith Orangeton or some, some kind of undesirable fruit like a tangerine lime lime disease yeah that's that's good lime disease let's get some close that'll be the closest we go yeah that's good very nice all right so that's Essentially one side complete. Now we have the fun job of turning this whole business around uh, and doing the other side. Now you see, if this was a Myford, you wouldn't be having this problem. <laughs> but it's not. The car and the plane were totaled, but well, people walked away fine. So nobody was in the front with Louise Bailey. She was feeling sicker and sicker and really getting feverish. And so at some point in Texas, they you know, realized that she was burning up with a fever and they had 